Yo, what's up? It's your favorite Samoan barkeep here. So tonight, we're going to compare the Jack Daniels Single Barrel Rye with the Jack Daniels Single Barrel Barrel Proof Rye. Let's jump in. Thanks for joining us today. Just a little history of me and Jack. Um, I always hated Jack Daniels my entire life. All people would hand me a Jack and Coke at the bar or a Jack and Soda. And you know, you never turn down a free drink, so I would drink them, but definitely my least favorite drinks of all time. Now that I'm getting back into bourbon, um, I'm finding that some of these releases from Jack Daniels are actually pretty solid. Alright, so we're going to jump into these. While we're getting these cracked and ready to go, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. It really helps the channel, it helps us keep this going, keep producing content for you, keep doing those bourbon hunts. But as always, thank you for watching, supporting the channel, and you know, let's keep it going. They've both been open for a couple of weeks now. Um, this one is an easy one to find around here, the single barrel rye. So you'll, you'll always see it on the shelves, store picks and everything. The barrel proof rye just hit a couple of weeks ago. Um, so it's kind of still hit or miss. You might be able to find it, you might not. Let's start off with the, uh, the lower proof, the single barrel rye. So this one is going to come in at a 47% ABV or 94 proof. And this one is a total wine and more master distiller selected uh, pick. Hmm. Smells delightful. So you get baking spices, a little bit of banana, a touch of sweetness. Mm, just tons of that banana. I love that smell. It is such an amazing scent on the nose. Jack Daniels Single Barrel Rye, 94 proof. Let's try it out. You get a lot of that spice flavor. You get a, just a slight little bit of heat in the, uh, the back of your throat. Just a little touch of heat, not much at all. So a little bit of the sweetness, a little bit of the bananas, a little touch of the, the wood, the oakiness. 94 proof, you get a solid finish, not amazing, but it lingers a little bit. You, you feel it, you still taste a little bit of that spice, a little bit of that rye. Now we're going to get into the Jack Daniels Single Barrel Barrel Proof Rye. So this one is coming in at a 67.95 ABV or 135.9 proof. Hopefully, uh, we're prepared for this jump in proof. Ooh. So on the nose on this one, I'm getting bananas, I'm getting caramel, kind of that bananas foster, really sweet, really banana forward. Yeah, just heavy on the bananas, heavy on the caramel. You don't get any of the alcohol that I was kind of expecting it with such a high proof. Don't get that at all. It just smells amazing. Let's try it out. First thing I notice is you get a lot more heat on this one, as you would expect with a over 40 higher proof. So you do get that uh, rye spice baking spices and you get a lot of sweetness and then this one you get the heat in the back of your throat and then as it goes down you get that nice uh, Tennessee hug and then the finish on this one is 
just ridiculous. It's still going. I'm still getting these flavors. Whew. Let's try it one more time. All right, so that time I got a little bit more of the banana and still tons of that caramel sweetness. The Jack Daniels Single Barrel Barrel Proof Rye. This is an amazing pour. I love this. It is so just tasty. The sweetness, the fruitiness, the proof level is great. You know, you get that burn, but it's not crazy overwhelming. The finish on this one compared to the regular is just night and day. This one just goes on forever. I would definitely say that both of these are worth the buy. So I think in my area, you're looking at the single barrel rye is around 40 to 50 bucks. And then the barrel proof is about 50 to 60. So, I mean, within the same range, I'd just say if you are a proof hound, you like the extra proof, definitely go over here. If you like yours with a little less of that heat, a little less of that burn, you can go here and still get great flavor and a great product. So I love rye, so I'm a little biased on this. I love rye, so I love both of these, but I definitely prefer this one. Hit me in the comments with other Jack Daniels products that you tried that I need to look out for. Um, the Jack Daniels 10 year and 12 year have just hit my area. I haven't seen any personally, but I've gotten reports from other people locally that have picked those up. Um, always on the hunt for any other of these Jack Daniels uh, or any other special releases. You know, so just very glad that I went back and tried some of these Jack Daniels pours because these are definitely not old number seven. These are very, very tasty and very, very worth picking up. As always, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Cheers.